let's check that whether my data set favors fixed effect model or random effect model uh, firstly we have to export data set to this data from excel or any other file or we can write the command where the data set is stored so i have written the command where my data set with the file name energy is saved in my system so this is the path so after you writing this uh, path i enter so now my data set has come into its data after this what we do that we declare this data this uh, uh, data set to be panel data so for declaring a data set to be a panel data we write this command so after writing this command press enter so now this has been declared that the data set you are using it is a panel data so xt set company code and here so you have to make company code for example if there are uh, six companies so you have to write uh, one 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 for uh, company one and for two two for company two so likewise uh, you have to write so uh, what is the time frame time frame is to from 2006 to 2016 so firstly I would write the uh, command for regression uh, in fixed effect model so this is the command xt red and ROA is my dependent variable and all these are my independent variables and this is a fixed effect model so after writing a fixed effect model uh, command we would run it by pressing enter and then we would store the result so this is the method to this is the command to store the uh, result of fixed effect model so after doing this what would what would we do that we again run the uh, regression command by writing uh, re uh, instead of uh, fe for uh, regression uh, for uh, uh, random effect model so again we press enter after writing the command so this is my random effect model and uh, again we have to restore it so this has been written estimates is to random we store this and after storing uh, both the result what we write we write horseman fixed so by writing this command we can uh, test that which model uh, is appropriate in my data set whether it is fixed effect model or a random effect model so uh, what is the guideline for this if the uh, ever if the p-value is less than uh, five percent then uh, my data set supports uh, fixed effect model if it is more than uh, five percent then uh, my data set uh, uh, supports uh, uh, random effect model uh, if it is more than five percent then uh, random effect model is appropriate random effect model is appropriate but uh, but here you see here you see that it is uh, less than five percent this means uh, this data set uh, is supporting uh, fixed effect model so uh, we are going to use fixed effect model but before this uh, we have to uh, uh, check uh, uh, for uh, uh, serial correlation heteroscedasticity and uh, uh, other diagnostic test uh, then only we can use fixed effect model otherwise we have to use some other model so so this data set supports uh, fixed effect model